We want to support the T helper 1 immune response because when Th2 is being overactive, the T helper 1 immune response, the part of the immune system that helps you to kill bugs, is not working strong enough. And this often causes people to have chronic infections. So what are some of the things we can use here? Well, we can use things like berberine. Now, berberine is an herb that really helps with blood sugar stability as well, but it has really great T helper 1 supportive immune properties. And then we have Chinese skull cap. Chinese skull cap is a herb that's very commonly used in Chinese medicine. It's a great T helper one immune support as well. And then things like sulforaphane and then glutathione, which is an antioxidant your body naturally produces, but you only make so much in a day. So you can run out of them if your body's really inflamed or dealing with a lot of chemicals. And glutathione can be very helpful as well as N-acetylcysteine, which is a precursor that your body can use to make glutathione from. Both of these can be very helpful to support the T helper one immune response.